my goodness. Well, good, wonderful, beautiful <laughs> morning, Podians. Um, it's been a few days since we have vlogged, and look, there is still snow. It has not gone anywhere. We've actually got more snow since Dan left. There's quite a bit. And it's supposed to snow again today and tomorrow. And on top of all of that, it is somebody's birthday today. Today is Eleanor's first birthday. Her birthday was November 20th. I know you guys are seeing this way past her birthday, but that's how vlogs work. You guys haven't figured it out by now. Vlogs end up coming out a little bit after we upload, mainly because we like to stay ahead. That way we don't miss days. Oh my goodness. She's like, it's my birthday, it's my birthday, it's my birthday. So Miss Eleanor turns one year old today. And if you guys wanna know if she's still very much a puppy, <sighs> look at, she figured out a new place to dig a hole through the ice over here where the holes don't belong. Holes belong over there, ma'am. She's like, I don't know. I think I'll put them wherever I want. Oh my gosh, you guys are so feisty. So yeah, this is what happens when it snows and it's cold and it stays this way. We get so excitable. Both on the A-frame at once, huh? That looks dangerous to me. That doesn't look like such a great idea. Yeah, like, we don't care, we're doing it anyway, because we're crazy. Hey, Miss Memphis, you want your breakfast? She's like, mm, maybe. I kinda, kinda like the snow too, it's kinda great. How about you girls, you hungry? Come on, let's go have breakfast. Here they come, and zoom. Well, would you look at that? We got a box! The next portion of today's video is sponsored by our amazing friends at HelloFresh. You guys know as well as we know that the holidays are here, which means everything is crazy busy. You know that, the vlogs are even all crazy all over the place right now. And one of the nice things about HelloFresh is one of the things I don't have to do is figure out what the heck we're gonna eat for dinner because the box is here and the meals are in it. I don't have to figure it out. The planning has been done for me. And as always, everything comes nice and packaged in the box and each bag is labeled for what's inside. They also have these little scan codes that you can scan in case you need the recipe. And as always, don't forget the ingredients under the ice. I see them down there, don't forget those. Oh, what wonderful goodness do we have to choose from today? Look, this is one of their lunch menus. We've actually had this one and it was amazing. So I was really excited to pick this again. Did you know that HelloFresh has over like 35 different menu options to choose from each week? And sometimes they have the same one. So if there's something you like, it comes back around. You can get it again. Epic nacho mac and cheese. That looks good. Ooh, griddled onion cheeseburgers. That looks good too. I think it might be that. I think you guys are gonna have to come back and see, but I think it might be that. That looks that looks really good. One of the other nice things about HelloFresh, you can see here, if you need dinner in a hurry, they have a lot of really easy 20 minute meal options. Uh, and you can see on each of the cards how long everything is gonna take. Like that one is a 10 minute, this one is a 10 minute prep, 35 minute cook, and this one is five minutes of prep, 25 minutes cook. So if you know how much time you have, you can look at your card and that can also help you decide what you're gonna eat. If you guys wanna get your own HelloFresh box, you can go to hellofresh.com and use the code SNOWDOGS 70 for 70% off plus free shipping. What? Did I find you an orange snake for your birthday? Look at it, it's so cute. It's so cute. Eleanor, this is my birthday toy. That's your birthday toy, girl. What else did you get for your birthday? She's like, I get to be a girl again. <laughs> for those of you wondering, we actually did schedule to get Eleanor fixed in February. So she will be getting fixed in February. We won't have to deal with that anymore. Oh, you got that? You got that snake toy? I couldn't believe I found an orange one. It's orange and yellow and it's so cute. It's so cute. Are you ready to do a birthday photo shoot? Huh? Are you, hey, hey, are you ready to do a birthday photo shoot? She's like, no, leave me alone. I'm playing with my toy. You specifically gave it to me. I did, didn't I? And who's mad at me for specifically giving it to you? That one. Are you mad? I gave you a toy too, but you didn't care. You wanted the one she had. It's her birthday. She gets to play with the toy. <laughs> you look so mad. <laughs> oh, all right, I'm gonna try to set up a little birthday photo shoot for you. What do you think? She's like, I'm gonna rip the tongue off of this, this little snaky here, cause that is pretty cool. <laughs> Happy birthday. I can't believe you're a year old already. Look it, we did it. We kind of set you up a little birthday backdrop. You're not having it though. She's like, I don't want to sit on my blue thing. I don't want to get my picture taken. Are you turning into a teenager or something? <laughs> you think this is funny? I just wanted to take your birthday photos. She's like, nope, I just want to go outside and play in the snow. I guess it is your birthday. You should get whatever you want, right? She ripped the tongue off the snake, by the way. Did you see I got her an orange snake, hun? Oh, 
And I, she ripped the tongue off of it. I said it when I gave it to her. Like, she's going to rip the tongue right off. Okay, we got you some balloons. She's a little freaked out by the balloons. I think that's why she doesn't want to sit in front of them. So we're just kind of letting her do her own thing. Your pictures will be cute regardless. I think the squirrels are building snowmen in the backyard. Look, there's a little one right there. And there's another one over there. And they keep digging and running around in the snow. They're probably looking for their nuts that they've hidden under the snow. But it was so cute. It looked like they were building little snowmen. Well, hello, birthday girl. Are you coming in here to help with your cute little diaper on? She's like, I'm so cute. Look how cute I am. You know, this is probably the last time you're going to have to wear that because you're getting fixed in February. So no more cute little diaper. What do you think of that? No more cute little diaper. She's going to get fixed in February and she is going to get the gastropexy done, which is the same thing we had done with uh, Kira. Yeah, I know. I know. I keep going back and forth on whether or not to do it, but I think I'm just going to do it. And if you guys are new here and you don't know what that is, so she's going to get fixed, which most of you should know what that is, but I'm going to do the elective, elective gastropexy. I had it done on Miss Kira. It is basically what it is, is they attach their stomach to the lining of their belly. It's to help prevent bloat, which those of you that may be new here, you may not know this, but our Oakley had gone through bloat three different times and then she had to have an emergency gastropexy done. Her stomach actually twisted. They had to open her up and untwist it and then they did a gastropexy. One of the ways you can prevent that is by doing an elective gastropexy. Miss Kira had that done when she got spayed and I'm getting it done to Miss Eleanor as well. Now bloat is not common in Huskies. It is, it's, they're not deep chested dogs. They're not big dogs. It's really not common, but it does happen. And the gastropexy, there's almost no like side effects to doing it. There's no real downside to doing it. And I figure since there's no downside to doing it, I'm gonna do it. She had it done and yours turned out just fine. The biggest thing is instead of taking like seven to 10 days to recover from a space surgery, it takes about two weeks because it's a much bigger incision, which also means you are gonna get to wear a really cute surgical suit. What do you think of that? She's like, I don't know, mom. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't worry, it's a few months away. It's not till February. Because we knew she was going into heat, I scheduled it out because you don't want to get them fixed when they're going through heat or just before or just after. You want to wait till they're all done doing all of that. Do you want to go outside? I bet you do. Okay, let's go outside. Oh my goodness. It gets so dark so early anymore. Please don't go digging in any of those holes. Hi, Miss Memphis. Ready? Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Don't worry, I already checked for squirrels. Oh, apparently the squirrel came back even after I checked for the squirrels. I don't know if you guys saw him, but he got away. <laughs> I literally just came and opened the door and checked for the squirrels and then one, there he is. One ran right across, there he goes. Hi, squirrel friend. What did I just say, ma'am? I said no digging. Eleanor, I don't care if it's your birthday, ma'am. And yes, it's Eleanor doing it. You know what she's doing? She's digging where the squirrels have been burying stuff, where you saw them out here earlier, burying stuff. What am I gonna do with you? I feel like you shouldn't get any cookie. You get a cookie because you're an angel. Oh, and you get a cookie because you came inside when I asked you to. But what about you? She's like, it's my birthday. I should get a cookie. But you dug another hole in the yard. It don't matter. There you go. Because you're cute. And because it's your birthday. Boop. All right, decisions have been made. We're gonna go with the epic nacho mac and cheese because it does sound pretty dang good. And we have all of our ingredients out of the bag and we have our amazing instructions. Super simple step-by-step -step instructions. We're gonna go ahead and make this. And of course, as always, even when you don't get anything, you are the best kitchen helper ever. You're the best kitchen helper number two, but you will always be the best kitchen helper number one. And then where, where, oh, where has Miss Kira girl gone? The oven's not even on yet, honey. Nothing is on yet. You can come hang out in here with us. She's like, nope, I'm prepared. I'm hanging out in here. Okay, you hang out in there. Boiling water for the noodles, heating up some oil, chopped up the peppers already, making the sauce. I gotta add a little bit of water to this. And then, uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep on cooking. What do you think? They're like, just drop something. Maybe you can have a noodle, maybe. Everything is starting to sizzle. Melting the butter, then we're gonna add some flour. Basically, we're making, what do they call it? Kind of like a roux. We're making the cheese sauce. That's what we're doing. It smells amazing, that's for sure. You know, this is so much easier than you think it's gonna be. Realistically, like, just stir it all together. We're making our own cheese sauce. 
Melting nice and good. Just keep stirring till it's all melted. Oh my goodness, it looks so good. Now I gotta broil it for like two minutes to melt all that cheese. Don't worry, I saved you a noodle. One for birthday girl first. Birthday girl gets a noodle. Memphis gets a noodle. And we'll go take one to Miss Kira because I don't think she's coming in here. Hi, Miss Kira. I brought you a noodle. See, I saved you some good stuff. Oh my goodness. It looks good, it smells good, now it's time to try it. Oh what, now that it's on the table, you're like, hey, I'll, I'll come in here now. Don't worry, they got noodles. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you wanna give us your review? It smells good. I say it might be hot. Look, yeah, I, looks, I fogged up the windows. <laughs> it looks hot. Oh, would you like some too hot? She's like, I would like noodle. some. Mom gave me a noodle, and mm. the noodle was pretty good. <laughs> Don't worry, birthday girl got a noodle too. Okay, I'll try one of the noodles. Even right. though it looks really hot. Don't burn yourself. It's really hot. Yeah, it's really creamy. Mm, mm -hmm. I made that. That wasn't a cheese sauce. I just want to point out <laughs> that HelloFresh taught me how to make real mac and cheese. That's pretty good, huh? That's pretty good. All right. Sweet. I'm going to eat mine. So dinner was amazing, and as you could tell, that was a four serving meal, which means we're gonna have leftovers. As always, you guys, if you wanna get your own HelloFresh box, you can go to hellofresh.com and use the code SNOWDOGSVLOGS70 for 70% 70 off plus free shipping. Now that our dinner is done, do you get special dinner because it's your birthday? Do you like some real beef, lamb, and bison in your dinner? What do you think? She's like, um, heck yeah, I would take that whole can. You can't have the whole can, you do have to share it with your sisters. But you'll get some special dinner since it's your birthday. You want a bite? Yeah, here you go. Oh my goodness, you can't swallow the fork. All right, everybody else will get a bite too, but that was your birthday bite. You, that's just a fork. I'll put some on your food, I swear. You guys will get bites too, I'm just not gonna film it. <laughs> Look, I made you soup for dinner. All right, this has to sit for a minute. So the rest of the food can soak up all the goodness and then you can have it, okay? You gotta, you gotta let it sit for like 15 minutes. Then, then you can have it, Miss Birthday Girl. Got your balloons. Do you wanna show everybody your trick? She's like, it's my birthday, do I have to? Yeah, let's show them, okay, ready? Leave it, ah, ah, leave it. Okay, take it. Good girl. Like, oh, I got birthday soups, birthday soups. I probably could have let the food soak up a little bit more, but they were extremely excited about eating them too. Don't worry, they got some too. They got some special food too to celebrate your first birthday. I still can't believe you're a year old. Are you really a year old? She's like, I am mom. I am a year old. I brought her birthday balloons down from on top of her kennel. <laughs> Is that good stuff? Best birthday dinner ever? Don't worry, I am gonna make you a cake. I just, uh. Don't know when. <laughs> Her birthday falls with the holidays and then we were gone and things just got so crazy. This is actually after the Novi Pet Expo, but I wanted to get this video out to you guys. So things are a little out of order, but it'll all make sense or something eventually. Saturday on the dog's channel will be Eleanor's birthday video. So if you guys sent something to Eleanor for her birthday, that video should go up on Saturday. That's the tentative plan. Hopefully the plans work out because Lately, the plans have been all over the place. <laughs> Was it good? Best birthday dinner ever, huh? She's like, that's pretty good. I will make you a cake, I promise. Just not today. What are you doing? You're crazy. Where did all this energy come from? She's like, I'm crazy. She is, she crazy. You can't do couch zoomies, you'll get in trouble. Are you still checking for more dinner? Oh my goodness. We are gonna go ahead and end this video here. Hi, Kira. We sat down and watched a movie together. Say we had a pretty good, pretty good birthday for little Miss Eleanor, but she keeps going back over there looking for more dinner. You don't need more dinner. You can have more food tomorrow. So we're gonna go ahead and end this video right here. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, boop, and we will see you again soon. Happy birthday, Miss Eleanor. She's like, it's my birthday, guys. And I had an amazing day. Good night, audience.